Ahoy! Curious minds! Today, we set sail on an incredible adventure to explore the hidden treasures of the ocean, gold. That's right, beneath the waves lie vast amounts of this precious metal, waiting to be discovered. Join me as we dive into the top 10 facts about gold in the oceans. From its origins to its extraction, we'll uncover fascinating insights that will leave you in awe. Welcome aboard the Robot Ray channel. Fact number 10. The Origins of Ocean Gold. The presence of gold in the Earth's oceans is a result of various geological processes over millions of years. Gold is not typically found in high concentrations in seawater, but rather in minute amounts, with estimates suggesting approximately 10 to 30 parts per trillion. The origins of ocean gold trace back to the Earth's formation, where gold-rich asteroids and meteors bombarded the planet. Over time, gold deposits were leached out of the Earth's crust by rainwater and rivers, ultimately finding their way into the oceans. The erosion of gold containing rocks and the transport of these particles by rivers contributed to the dispersion of gold in seawater. While the concentration of gold in the oceans is relatively low compared to terrestrial deposits, the sheer volume of the world's oceans results in a substantial total quantity of gold. Despite its dilute nature, researchers have explored methods to extract gold from seawater, although the challenges associated with cost-effective extraction limit the practicality of this endeavor. Understanding the origins of ocean gold provides valuable insights into the complex interplay between geological and hydrological processes that have shaped the distribution of this precious metal on our planet. Fact number 9. The Sunken Treasures. The ocean floor holds a unique kind of sunken treasure in the form of submerged gold deposits. Over geological time, gold particles have gradually settled to the ocean floor through various natural processes. These processes include the erosion of gold-rich rocks on land, which releases gold particles into rivers. These rivers then transport the gold to the ocean, where the heavier gold particles settle on the seabed due to gravity. This natural accumulation of gold on the ocean floor has led to the formation of submerged gold deposits, sometimes referred to as placer deposits, mirroring the process that occurs in riverbeds. While these underwater gold deposits are intriguing, extracting gold from the ocean floor poses significant technological and environmental challenges. The depths and pressures of the ocean, along with the sheer scale of the task, make mining these sunken treasures a complex and costly endeavor. Despite the allure of underwater gold, current extraction technologies are not economically viable, and the environmental impact of such operations remains a concern. As technology continues to advance, the possibility of tapping into these sunken treasures may evolve, but it requires careful consideration of the environmental and economic implications. Fact number 8. The Gold's Elusive Nature. Gold's presence in the oceans is marked by its elusive and sparse distribution. The concentration of gold in seawater is incredibly low, estimated at around 10 to 30 parts per trillion. Despite the vastness of Earth's oceans, the overall quantity of gold dispersed in seawater is relatively small. The challenge lies in the fact that gold is evenly distributed across the world's oceans, making it impractical to extract economically significant amounts. While gold's presence in the oceans highlights the intricate processes of erosion, transport, and deposition over geological time, the quest for commercially viable methods to extract gold from seawater remains an elusive endeavor due to the minute concentrations involved. Efforts to extract gold from the oceans have been explored, but the cost and technological challenges associated with such endeavors have proven to be significant barriers. Researchers continue to investigate innovative techniques for gold extraction, driven by the allure of tapping into this vast and unconventional source of the precious metal. However, the elusive nature of gold in the oceans underscores the delicate balance between scientific curiosity, economic viability, and environmental sustainability in the pursuit of such extraordinary resources. Fact number 7. The Accumulation Process. The accumulation of gold in the oceans is a result of a complex geological and hydrological process that spans millions of years. Gold-rich rocks on land undergo weathering and erosion, releasing tiny gold particles into rivers. These rivers then transport the gold particles to the ocean, where the heavier gold settles on the seabed due to gravity. Over time, this process has led to the formation of submerged gold deposits on the ocean floor, known as placer deposits. 
The accumulation of gold in the oceans is thus a testament to the dynamic interplay between geological forces and hydrological systems that shape the Earth's surface. Fact number 6. The Seafloor Mining Techniques Seafloor mining techniques for extracting gold from the ocean's depths involve advanced technologies and present considerable engineering challenges. One method being explored is known as hydrothermal vent mining. Hydrothermal vents on the ocean floor are rich in minerals, including gold, and are formed by hot, mineral-laden fluids emerging from beneath the Earth's crust. These vents create deposits called polymetallic sulfides, which can contain valuable metals like gold, silver, and copper. Specialized remotely operated vehicles ROVs, equipped with cutting and collecting tools are used to extract these deposits. However, the technical complexities and the extreme conditions of the deep-sea environment pose significant obstacles to effective and sustainable seafloor mining. Another seafloor mining approach involves using autonomous or remotely operated machines to collect mineral-rich nodules found on the ocean floor. These nodules contain various metals, including gold, and are often found in areas like the Clarion Clipperton Zone in the Pacific Ocean. Machines equipped with vacuum systems or other collection mechanisms would harvest these nodules, and the extracted minerals would be brought to the surface for processing. Seafloor mining techniques are still in the experimental and research stages, with ongoing efforts to address environmental concerns, technological limitations, and regulatory frameworks surrounding deep-sea mining activities. Fact number 5. The Environmental Impact The long-term consequences of large-scale ocean mining remain uncertain. The biodiversity of the deep sea is still not fully understood, and disturbing these ecosystems could have far-reaching ecological implications. As researchers and industry stakeholders explore the potential of extracting gold and other minerals from the oceans, it is crucial to carefully assess and mitigate the environmental impact of these activities to ensure the sustainability of marine ecosystems and minimize harm to biodiversity. Balancing the desire for valuable resources with responsible environmental stewardship is a key challenge in the ongoing discussion about the feasibility and ethics of deep-sea mining. Fact number 4. The Uncharted Depths The depths of the world's oceans remain largely uncharted and mysterious, representing one of the least explored frontiers on Earth. While scientists have made significant strides in mapping the ocean floor, much of the seafloor's intricate details, especially in the deep ocean, remain unknown. The vastness of the oceans and the extreme conditions of the deep sea, including high pressure, low temperatures, and limited visibility, pose formidable challenges to exploration. As a result, large portions of the ocean floor, where potential gold deposits may exist, remain unexplored and unmapped. Fact number 3. The Geological Wonders The presence of gold in the oceans is intricately linked to geological wonders that span millions of years. Gold is primarily sourced from rocks on land that undergo weathering and erosion, releasing minute gold particles into rivers. These rivers then carry the gold to the ocean, where the heavier particles settle on the ocean floor due to gravity. Over geological time, this process has given rise to submerged gold deposits known as placer deposits, forming geological wonders beneath the waves. The interplay of geological forces, from the formation of gold-rich rocks to the transportation and deposition of gold particles, contributes to the creation of these underwater treasures. Geological wonders associated with ocean gold also extend to hydrothermal vents, where hot, mineral-laden fluids emerge from beneath the Earth's crust. These vents create deposits called polymetallic sulfides, containing valuable metals including gold. The existence of such hydrothermal vent systems on the ocean floor is a testament to the dynamic geological activity taking place deep within the Earth. The exploration of these geological wonders not only enhances our understanding of Earth's processes but also underscores the potential for valuable resources hidden in the depths of our oceans. Fact number 2. The Role of Underwater Volcanoes Underwater volcanoes play a crucial role in the distribution of gold in the oceans. These volcanic systems, also known as hydrothermal vents, are located on the ocean floor and are associated with tectonic plate boundaries. The intense geological activity around these vents creates an environment where hot, mineral-laden fluids are released from beneath the Earth's crust. These fluids carry various metals, including gold, which can accumulate in deposits known as polymetallic sulfides. 
The process involves the interaction of seawater with the hot rocks, leaching out minerals and creating unique geological formations on the ocean floor. The role of underwater volcanoes in gold distribution extends to areas around these vents, contributing to the overall complexity of oceanic ecosystems. The presence of gold-rich minerals near hydrothermal vents showcases the interconnectedness of geological and biological processes in the deep sea. Understanding the influence of underwater volcanoes on gold dispersion provides valuable insights into the Earth's dynamic processes and offers clues to the potential resource wealth hidden beneath the ocean's surface. Fact number 1. The Quest for Ocean's Gold the quest for ocean gold represents a fascinating frontier in the exploration of Earth's resources. While gold has been traditionally mined on land for centuries, the allure of tapping into the vast and uncharted depths of the world's oceans has ignited scientific and economic interest. The quest for ocean gold involves exploring innovative technologies and mining techniques that can extract valuable metals, including gold, from the seabed. Researchers are utilizing remotely operated vehicles, ROVs, and autonomous machines to navigate the challenging conditions of the deep sea and collect mineral-rich nodules or polymetallic sulfides from hydrothermal vents. And there you have it, Curious Minds. The Top 10 Fascinating Facts About Gold in the Oceans From sunken treasures to geological wonders, the ocean holds secrets and riches beyond imagination. Join me for more captivating explorations and breathtaking discoveries on the Robot Ray channel. If you found this video fascinating and informative, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Robot Ray channel for more incredible explorations. Thanks for watching, and until next time, keep on exploring.